Hello everybody and welcome to this very wet and cold midwinter Baileys and Wild update. We've got a few things to talk to you about but I basically wanted to come on and let you know that we are still here. We've not got boat fatigue or anything. We do want to still create videos and build Firefly alongside you. Um, there's just been a lot of things that's happened this month um, that we are going to have to talk to you guys about. So, um, if you've watched our first video, you'll be well aware of what I'm about to say. Um, and it's probably something I'm going to be using as an excuse and a reason quite a lot. But mum is ill. Um, she's not got very good lungs um, and she's got a lot of autoimmune problems. Um, winter is usually a difficult time of the year for her. Um, she was ill mid-November, um, early December. So I was looking after her. Um, through then and because she's got low bone density as well she's also broken a couple of ribs so it's not been a great month and a half for her she's doing well at the moment she's she's managing and coping um, and she's going to get a decent rest over Christmas but that's mainly the large reason why we haven't been at the boat and haven't been able to work on Firefly with regards to Firefly, um, in the last um, boat restoration video we did, we were working on getting water out of her. Um, we've checked her a couple times since then, and there's still water leaking in from somewhere, so we are going to have to figure that out as soon as humanly possible. We were going to try and work over on her over Christmas, um, try and get um, framework and things in her as soon as possible, but uh, we figured it's probably pointless if there's still water leaking in from somewhere. So the main priority still at the moment is to find out where water is leaking in. That's the main problem. Um, we do have a flow chart that we are working from as well that we are going to link in the description. If anybody's got any suggestions, um, things that we could include, then that would be really, really helpful. Uh, we do want to try and get her in by April, May. We want to get her in the water by April, May, because we want to be sailing her. <laughs> we desperately want to be sailing her. So we want to get her in early spring. Um, that might end up meaning that we change the layout of the way we do videos. Um, we're going to need to do a lot more work than we show on camera, um, which will end up changing the format and how we do them. But hopefully it should mean that you get more content per video. So you've got that to look forward to, hopefully. <laughs> Um, it will most likely be better for us doing work anyway because we spent a lot of time trying to include as much content as possible of what we were doing in the videos but that ended up meaning that we spent a lot of time focusing on what we got on camera and what we included rather than doing actual work then so that kind of hindered us quite a lot so hopefully this will give us the opportunity to have more in each video especially since we're going to have to get this rushed in the next few months. Um, something else I wanted to mention as well is you might end up seeing um, different kind of content in a way. <laughs> the original idea for Baileys in Wild was to be an outdoor adventure channel to get us out and about. Um, but unfortunately we had to start making Firefly better before we can actually start adventuring on her. So. Um, it won't be on Firefly immediately because she still needs fixing, but in the coming months, hopefully you'll see more content geared towards adventuring and being outdoors because um, that was the original intention of the channel. Right, so difficult topic and we are usually vehemently opposed to asking for help, but if we are going to get Firefly done quickly in the next few months and we've had quite a lot of people asking for ways that they can help, there are links down in the description for you guys to help if you'd like to. You know, if you've seen or found any value in the videos and the content we create, and if you love Firefly as much as we do and would like to see her in the water someday, there are ways that you can help. There's Amazon Wishlist, which we use as a personal um, checklist for things we need in Firefly anyway. We have a buy me a coffee link, um, I thank you to David as well, by the way, who's bought us a few coffees in the last few weeks. Thank you very much. Um, and we also have a PayPal link in the description as well. We've had quite a lot of people ask for ways that they can contribute. Um, there is absolutely no pressure. If, if you can't, we love you all anyway equally. But we've had quite a lot of requests and, and inquiries of how people can help. So those are some ways you can if you'd like to. All right, so the wind and the rain and the weather in general is trying to desperately push me off camera, so I'm going to wrap it up. 
I wish everybody a very Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays. If we don't end up seeing you before the end of the year, I wish you a very Merry New Year and I hope the New Year is kind to you. When we do start uploading videos, we're going to be doing so in earnest. We definitely want Firefly finished. Um, please give us a little subscribe if you'd like to be notified um, for when we do start uploading. Important you press the little bell as well because that matters. Um, and give the video a little like to kind of urge Google to make sure that it does still know that we are intending on making Bill Isn't Wild, you know, a thing still. We are still intending on that. Um, thank you very much for the support we've received and we will see you in the new year. Thank you very much for watching. Bye. Uh, Oh, 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 I'm trying to hide the fact that I'm shivering. Oh, okay. Oh. Yes, the, oh, murmuration. That was really pretty. <laughs> yeah, so.